Let's start out this episode by stating one thing. I am stupid. What's up, guys? It's Josh. Welcome back to another Minecraft video, and today we're playing our modded Let's Play again. I don't remember what episode this is, but we're here's the return of it, and basically I recorded the returning episode already, but a little bit into it I realized that I forgot to activate my audio, so I did a lot in that episode, and then I realized I had no audio, so I'm going to go over and just explain what I did in that episode real quickly here, and we'll continue on. In this one so let's first I just want to light this stuff up it's annoying me so first of all I built this thing here this is an energy collector and this is an energy condenser or I had that opposite this is the collector and this is the condenser and what it's doing is this here will fill this bar up I place any block in here so I can place like a wooden block and it'll fill that bar up or I can place, uh, crap, I can place this silver in here, and what it'll do is it will fill this up here. Now, what I did was I installed a couple more mods, and basically out there, I realized by uninstalling red power and then reinstalling it, I lost silver ingots in the world, so I need to spawn some I had to spawn one silver ingot and what I'm doing is I'm duplicating it here but other than that this world's going pretty well I created a alloy furnace and then we pretty much what we did the recipes for those are pretty heavy so that's pretty much what we did here uh, if we head out here uh, we have our farm going here and that's looking good and up there's our tree farm which is looking good so let's just make sure I have my brightness up and now I want to do that real quickly and I want to figure out what we can do to make an apiary this here uh, I believe this is what it is the apiary or yeah so we need 10 gears and a sturdy machine and to make a sturdy machine we need bronze so then we need copper and tin so let's see what we have that's copper I think we have um, copper here and we need some tin now we need only eight of this so if we place this here one two there now we can go around like this there's 30 machine bronze age and then we're going to need some glass and tin gears. So tin gears, stone gears, wooden gears. Okay. So we'll let's make some wooden gears. We need four of them. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Four. Now we need this here. One, two, three, four. 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 Now, do we have any more tin? Do we have any tin ore? Yes. Okay, we need only one more tin for this to work. So let's grab, wait, get this one tin, then let's start this up. All right, so we head in here. Let's place our four stone gears in here. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Tin gears, one, two, three, four. Now we have there. I forgot that we need some glass, so let's head over here. Let's place this here. Now we need two, three, four glass. And we can place this here. Four glass, one, two, three, four. Tin gears on the side. Apiary. Okay, so our apiary goes out here, right there. And look at that update. Wow. Climate, temperature, warm, humidity, damp. This is cool. I haven't seen this update yet. Owner, JCAT Films, access, shared, restricted, private. That's pretty cool. That's for servers. Okay, did you know nether warts are the nether flowers? Okay. Climate. Okay. So let's grab our bee that we have over here. That got messed up at some point. There. We got some drone here. Now we're going to need to grab a queen also. So we can place this. There we got steadfast drone. Now we're gonna need to grab a queen. Let's leave that there, that there. 
So our mission here for right now is to go out. We're going to find a queen bee, and that requires going and getting a... What's it called? I can't... Finding a nest. So we need a scoop. And to make a scoop, we need... Okay, any color wool. So do we have any wool? I think that's the one thing I don't have is wool. Because I would have a bed and I could sleep through the night. Let's go find a sheep real quickly. Sheep, please don't be far away. Is that a creeper laying out in my farm over here? That is. There's a sheep. Oh, nope. Stupid cow in my food. Hmm. We need a sheep. Do sheeps even spawn in? Oh, there's a... Right there is a... Beehive, so... Let's, we need to find a sheep really fast. Come on. Stupid game doesn't spawn sheeps when you need them. Don't you have you ever noticed that you always get sheeps when you don't need them? Oh, come on. At least snow doesn't make any noise. Alright, I have my brightness up. Skeleton, don't need you. Don't need to fall down there either. What mode are we even on? Are we in normal? Yeah. Okay. So. Found a cow. Does it not rain in jungles? Because that's awesome. That's. Sheep. Yeah, there we go. We found one more. By any chance? I only want one more because. We can make a bed if we get one more. And that's our prior... Oh, wait, no. I have a um, transmutation table, so I can make a bed anyway. So I can, we'll just place a sheep in there. It'll learn what it is, and then I can buy a one thing. So let's head back to our house. Not falling in there again. And uh, do you guys have any suggestions for what I should do in this series? Uh, they are... They are greatly appreciated. Oh, it does rain in. Apparently it just started raining. Because it definitely is raining in our jungle biome. Okay. So if we head in here. Transmutation table. Wall. Okay. By one, two. Oops. I grabbed the wrong thing. Okay, now let's go over to our crafting bench. Wood. Apparently I can't get any wood. Wood. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. Bed. Bed over here. And sleep to daytime. So, let's turn the sound down just a little bit. Uh, fan I, for some reason, I don't know why my settings don't seem right. Okay. So, let's head into this. We need to make a few sticks. We need four. We need more than four. Six. There's twelve. Just like that. And scoop. Perfect. Let's throw this stuff here because we don't need this for right now and that can go thrown here food you'll get thrown just down here for right now and then shears are coming with us and let's head over to that thing we had over here I can't remember the name the beehive that we found over here Beehives, it seems like it's easier to find them at nighttime because they glow. So when we get there, we right click with the scoop or we just break it. I can't remember exactly. Now, this better be some good bees. And you better give me a queen. I'll be disappointed if I don't get a queen. 
So then I have to go on and search for another one. Okay, there's a queen. Perfect. So what is this? Forest princess, forest drone. Okay. So, we're going to find more at some point, but let's head back home. There's our house over there. Let's throw these things into our apiary. Do we need... I have a feeling that we need flowers for it, so we'll grab one bone meal, and we'll just decorate it with flowers. That's just my theory. Is that we need, like, a flower or something to add to it, so... We're heading here. Right up there. I think we have a bone. There. We go. And... Let's breed. Should I crossbreed for the first time? Eh, we'll do a regular one this time. I need a regular flower. There you go. Not some of these crappy flowers. Okay, so it should be making... Hostile environment? What does that mean? Og. So it needs to be in a different biome, it seems. Let's see if we bring it over to a different biome, what happens. I guess we're going to need some bees from this biome, but from what I understand is those sting us, so I don't want to get those kind of bees, but we can go looking for one real quickly, and alright, where possibility of finding a beehive somewhere, that would be great, otherwise we'll have to move into the dark into a snow biome, which I don't want to build our, a apiary like thing in the snow biome. Now, uh, looking up in the trees, nighttime would be helpful right now. The one time I want night, it's when I want a day. I'm not a good beekeeper, as you can probably tell. <gasps> Sheep. <sighs> yeah, there we go. All right. I'm pretty sure I've seen a beehive in this jungle, though. Somewhere in this jungle, I've seen a beehive before. Hmm. But where did I see it? That is the question. Will it blend? That is the question. Um, beehive over here. Alright, I'll be back when I find a beehive. Alright, so I found a beehive slightly outside of the jungle we had. And they're meadow drones. So... Uh, this is a forest drone and forest queen, so let's head back to our house. Now that it was just slightly outside, um, hopefully it'll still let us use it. That was easy, but let's head back real quickly and let us see. Let us see. So at some point I'm going to make a second apiary. And then I think what I'm going to do is, I, I don't know if any of you guys have seen Direwolf's Let's Play, but what he has is this mod, I don't know what it's called, but it allows him to teleport from different worlds and different areas, and if anybody can help me tell me what it is, that would be really great. But, let's head back over to our house. Pretty sure our house is over here. So I'm still looking for some light glowing areas, just in case I can find a jungle bee hive, because I know they do exist. I'm not going to doubt myself. There's our house. 
found one. We found one. Yes. Okay. Maybe these ones will work. Okay, tropical. Yes. Perfect. That was lucky. See, I knew I've seen one right by our house. I just didn't know where it was. Okay. Get off of my roof. Okay, let's head back out here. We can place our apiary again. And... Let's first do this meadow, see if these meadows will work in here. And if it does, then I will be happy. Okay. So it's not daytime, we gotta head back in and sleep real quickly. I forgot that they only work in daytime. Now I think the other ones didn't work because it was too warm for them to breed. Ah, okay. So, tropicals, the tropical bees will work here, though. There we go. So you can see it's throwing some stuff out. So that's working now. We can throw this in here. I actually think I'm gonna build a bee chest real quickly. And then, we'll see what we'll do. What is this? Holy crap. Um. Show unused. Maybe? Does that go away now? Yeah, okay. So let's build a chest for our bees. Out there. Now my friend had problems with bees where he got near it and they would sting him. Or he thought they would sting him, but... I don't know if that's going to be problematic for us, but, alright, so, no flowers, hive members are not finding the right flowers, what kind of flowers does it need? Mm. Let's get this thing working before I end this episode. Okay, it should have the right flowers now. I have one of each kind of flower that's default to the game. If you don't work now, I swear I will kill this thing. Come on. Aren't these the only kind of flowers? I'll place that too. What kind of flowers is in need? I'm gonna look it up. Um, you guys can only see the game, but I'm gonna look uh, forestry beekeeping. Okay, so the apiary goes there. Now, bees drone. Um, tropical bees flowers. Flowers uh, forestry. Okay, so hardcore, if you need breeding, if you think breeding is too easy or fast, set that, okay. Okay, forest meadow, noble, majestic imperil. Uh, tropical breeze, humidity, damp, silky, temperature, hot, humidity, damp. So temperature, climate, warm. Heredity, recessive, but it should be um hot here. Are we too close? This beekeeping has got much harder since... From what I remember, it used to be. Maybe if we get a little further away from that over there, you know, because I think that may be too close to 
temperature warm? Do we need to be in a desert? Because I don't know. I'll go over to a desert, I guess. I wonder if I place it here. Temperature normal. This is really confusing. Hmm. So it needs to be a wet climate, so it has to be in this um, biome. It only makes sense because it's hot in a jungle, but it's in a... And it's warm in a jungle, and it's humid in a jungle, but in a desert, it's not humid. So maybe if I place it in here. I'm just trying to search around. This is kind of weird. They've really updated this beekeeping since last time I've done it. Hmm... Last chance. Okay, warm. I guess we'll stay with this warm. I don't know what it needs, but... I'll try it one more time. And I need to figure out what flowers it requires, because it seems like it does need flowers, but I don't know. I have all the flowers in the game that default to Minecraft, because I'm sure this mod doesn't add its own kind of flowers, so... Let's place it back over here. I'm gonna look it up real quickly. Okay, so tropical branch. Oh, those aren't tropical bees. Um. So. Tropical bees, flowers, uh... Stretch of trees. Tropical bees, um... Okay, tropical bees. Tropic... What type of flowers do tropical bees need? Minecraft forestry short guide okay mating genetics mutation so um flowering determine the rate at which a bee will pollinate flowers around the apiary okay species speed so um fertility sorry if you hear something upstairs okay flower provider bees require flower most just want a nice yellow flower some We'll want some other closer, so kung, uh, cacti, jungle plants, and a few have very exotic tastes. So what are jungle plants? It says jungle hive. But what are jungle plants? Maybe... I don't think there's anything that's like, specific to a jungle, is there? This? Um... Maybe that will do it. A fern, possibly. We can try it. Um, so let's place this bee in here again. And I don't think there's any kind of specific thing that it requires. Um, I'll come back to you in a second. Oh, it's working. It needs that fern. You can see over here it's working. Okay. That is good. That is good. Finally we figured it out. Okay, that's working. So. That's pretty good. Alright. Well, that's what I got for you guys today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, I ask you please leave a rating. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.